Stay connected. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Coach, today is your day. We celebrate you. What are your thoughts on today and your achievement? Well, right now I'm kind of exhausted because I didn't know what to expect. And uh, I saw some people I haven't seen in years come back. And that really, really made me feel good. And, and you know, when you're teaching and coaching for as long as you hope you reach kids and you hope the parents understand what you did for their, their children. And I think it showed today that I, I, I did th some things right, I guess. And, uh, but I'm very proud and I'm, I'm humbled. And, uh, but again, the best part is having former players come back. So, Tell me about, um, so I mean, obviously in the background, we hear all of your former players, you know, playing in the alumni game and things like that. Um, and you got to speak with a lot of them, whether it be that you see them maybe at a restaurant locally or at the games, things like that. What is a message that you can repeat, that you feel comfortable repeating, that might have been said to you that you didn't know that, you know, really touched your heart? Well, I, I don't, I can't really single out one moment, but it's the fact that, you know, you're getting, getting embraced by former players who, who say thank you. And, and my proudest moment of them is the, I always wanted character kids, you know, I wanted them to be good fathers, employees, um, that sort of thing. And, and to stay out of trouble. And I would say out of the players I've coached 90 probably nine percent of them have lived up to that billing which it just fills my heart with pride that you had a little bit to do hopefully to do with it any message that you would like to give uh, the community or anyone watching this that may have not have had the opportunity to be here to hear anything uh, you'd like to say I or? guess the biggest two words are thank you uh, greatly appreciative um, again I have had so much support since I started coaching in really 1985 because I did some a junior high and JV year before I even got to the varsity in 1988. But, uh, you know, they really bought in, you know, unlike where basketball, they, they, everybody thinks they know the game. You know, soccer, I never had a real problem with any parent thinking they out knew me because I played in college. I, I had a good understanding of things and I tried to do what was best for their, their child. So I guess pride in that is, is probably what I will take back the most from. Thank you, coach. Thank you very much. Stay connected. Make sure you hit the subscribe button.